trends toward highly loaded, downsized engines, coupled with efforts to reduce fuel consumption and CO2 outputs, are pushing powertrain design to new levels. Mechanical and thermodynamic stresses in the combustion chamber demand super robust base engine components and advanced coatings to extend engine capability. Bob Sturck, Chief Application Engineer at Federal Mogul, explains how the company's IROX polymer coated engine bearings withstand mechanical loads produced by heavily boosted engines, and how this process helps overcome many of the wear related issues associated with frequent engine restarts found in hybrid and other stop start engines. I'd like to take the opportunity to talk about our innovative uh, polymeric coating called IROX for engine bearings. This coating was developed to abate wear and start stop in hybrid engines. Uh, future engines, uh, future car engines will be like golf carts where you, where you pull up to a stop sign or a uh, traffic light and the engine will completely stop. It's on the restart when you put your foot back into the gas, the engine will restart. That's when bearing wear can occur uh, in the most severe manner. So this coating was really developed in order to abate that wear in those situations. We can see in the future maybe 250,000 to 500,000 restarts with these start-stop hybrid type vehicles. But a side benefit that we got with the coating is that on aluminum substrates, it actually increases the fatigue strength by about 15 to 20 percent. Now this fits in really well with some of the strategies that the OEMs have for downsizing engines because as they downsize, they're adding supercharging or turbocharging boosting technologies to get more horsepower. These uh, bearings will actually handle more load due to those boosting technologies. So it fits into their wheelhouse in several ways, abate wear and handle the higher loads from downsizing. First step of the process and probably one of the most important steps is that they go into a chamber where we roughen the surface to receive the coating. This gives us almost a mechanical bond as well as a chemical bond. So they come out of the blast chamber and they have to be cleaned. This is a very important step because we don't want any of that blast residue left on the bearings prior to coating. So we go into a ultrasonic wash. This has four stations and the bearings come out very, very clean. You can see the dull matte finish on the idea of the bearing at this point and getting ready to go into the spray booth. Here we are inside the spray booth. The robot is picking up a row of bearings and putting them into this column. He takes two rows and puts them into a long tube, if you will, of, of bearings. And as they move around this rotary table, there are several things that happen here. The first station is a hot air blowing onto these bearings to, to warm them up. It uh, receives the coating a little bit better. But once they're sufficiently warm, uh, we spin the bearings and the nozzle comes through and it sprays the coating in, one coat, comes back down and sprays on the way up a second coat. Very uh, similar to a painting technology. The column is separated, the robot picks the uh, row of bearings up, each row, and sets them on a conveyor that goes through a curing oven uh, to harden the uh, coating. And here they're exiting the other end of the furnace, the robot's picking them up, putting them into uh, a machine that will inspect and engage the parts. Innovative technologies like Federal Mogul's IROX engine bearings provide our customers with advanced solutions that improve fuel economy, reduce emissions, and enhance vehicle durability. Federal Mogul, the heart of powertrains.